House GOP moves to block Biden's constitutional violation. New bill would stop IRS spying in its tracks what's happening. Millions of Americans were shocked to learn that Biden wants to use the IRS to spy on their financial transactions. Hidden within his massive $3.5 trillion bill was a provision that required banks to report transactions of $600 or more to the IRS. Not only would that create a mess for banks, but it would give the IRS incredible power to scrutinize your money. We still can't predict the fate of Biden's IRS scheme, nor the larger socialist bill. But Republicans are taking steps to prevent Biden from getting away with this. And they are putting their names on it. From Fox Business. House Republicans plan to unveil a bill on Friday to block the Biden administration's deeply controversial proposal to give the Internal Revenue Service additional scrutiny over most Americans' bank accounts in order to crack down on wealthy tax cheats. The bill from Rep. Drew Ferguson, Arga, would prohibit Treasury Secretary Janet Yellen from requiring financial institutions to report the inflows and outflows of any account they maintain, excluding any monitoring that exists under current law. Republicans in the House will introduce a bill banning Biden from giving the IRS greater power over our finances. This bill was sponsored by Florida's Drew Ferguson and supported by every Republican member of the House Ways and Means Committee. It would prevent the government from forcing banks to report transactions to the IRS. Biden's scheme seems pretty obvious. He claims he's trying to track down wealthy Americans who are trying to cheat the IRS. But there are already ways for the government to investigate rich individuals who try to hide large sums of money. No, this plan seems directed at middle and working class folks. After all, it would require your bank to tell the IRS whenever $600 or more went into or out of your bank account. That means paychecks, purchases, loans, and withdrawals would be sent to the IRS. At any time, the IRS could find a reason to audit and harass you and charge you more on tax day. Anyone with a third grade education would say that is a violation of privacy. Not only that but it would put a massive new financial burden on banks, which would have to figure out how to report all these transactions to the government. That would result in higher fees for basic services like checking and savings accounts. This doesn't appear to be a way to tax the rich for their fair share, but an attempt by the federal government to leech regular Americans of their already heavily taxed income. And, of course, making the bloated, wasteful government even richer.